My name is Mary Crawford Lawrence, and I'm the owner of Thrift and Thimble. And we sell um, vintage, secondhand, thrifted, home decor, clothing. And I also, the thimble is the sewing side of the business. So I rework vintage pieces. We really started it as more selling home decor, um, vintage clothing, shoes, purses, accessories, like you name it, doing pop-up shops. The clothes are from like the 60s and the 70s, 80s, even, you know, earlier or later. One of the things that's really fun about this business is that every day really does look different. Sometimes it's sitting at my sewing machine for like eight hours straight. I'm delivering pieces. I have to go find all the things that I'm gonna rework and sell and that's the most fun part. We've spent the last like year and a half really just trying to build our audience and build a community and a customer base and meet people, market, really just like figure out our brand and doing pop-ups um, most weekends, sometimes doing them Saturdays and Sundays. It's been fun. It's challenging. This business is very centered around like sustainability. We just want to encourage people to like have a different perspective on, on things like you know, the tagline, one man's trash is another man's treasure. I'm very thankful that I have my husband. He encourages me constantly and works all week long and then works all weekend with me and is my biggest supporter and pushes me to like continue this business. I try to focus on those full circle moments to really like, you know, imposter syndrome is like that feeling where you're in this space, but you almost don't feel like you belong in that space or that like, you know, people won't want what you're putting out there. So we were walking around this pop-up shopping and then two years later, we were vending at that pop-up and it wasn't until the first time that we finished our full day working this market. It was like an 11 hour day and I got like a little emotional at the end of the day. I was like, babe, like to my husband, I was like, we used to walk around and shop, not even thinking that we would ever be like one of these stores. And now we're one of these like shops at these markets. It's important to like, look at how much you've grown. And, and it's also really encouraging too, because it just makes me think like, okay, well, what else is coming? Like, what else can we do? How else are we going to grow? Mm -hmm.